You can hear people chanting right now, this is illegal. So a lot of occupiers, as you can see, have gathered around for this possible arrest of this one girl. So now I've made my way to the other side. I actually weaved all the way around from here all the way over there. And you can just see the crowd who is now protesting this possible arrest of this woman, Cynthia. So we are unclear right now what she could be facing or if this is just a simple detainment to get her out of the park uh, while the parks committees, the, sorry, the park workers are able to get their work done again because we're hearing she was obstructing one of the vehicles there. So, okay, so uh, we're going to continue to monitor. Melanie, she's just been put into the truck. The door is being closed. Police, uh, dozens of police officers surrounding it so that no one mm -hmm. else can get nearby. Um, but interesting, but to date, up until this moment, uh, police have not detained anyone. No, that's right, Cynthia. It's uh, it's actually been very peaceful, and I just checked in with you a few moments ago, and I said just that, that it has been peaceful, no arrests made, and uh, now we're seeing the first person being taken here from uh, St. James Park, and possibly not the last. Here's a shot right now. Officers are speaking to the woman inside this truck. Um, they did say earlier, uh, the officer in that scrum to media said that she would be released shortly. Uh, timing, we don't know what that means but uh, it seems just our cameras are here right now as they speak to this uh, to this female I'm gonna see if I can actually make my way around here and see them are coming out oh we need you back we're losing Mel. your audio Mel here she is uh, here we go here she is she's just come out of the truck right now a big hug from one of her friends here I'm just trying to see what officers are going to be giving to this woman she has a ticket in hand you can actually see from my perspective she's holding a yellow ticket in her hand I'm going to see if officers will be letting her go from this point or if they're going to be continuing to detain her. Uh, only our cameras are capturing this shot right now. We can see from our mast cam as well as our live cams here right now, it looks as though she is being released. I'm gonna have a listen in to his explanation to the woman. We just ask your name this again, is the please. woman uh, live, Aiden. the Aiden. one who was just arrested. We're going to take a listen in. No. <laughs> listen in. Oh, no. You don't have to say that. Okay. Thank you so much. Do you, Aiden, do you have a ticket right right the ticket was for? Yeah, I, do, I don't really want to talk about too many other things yeah. right now. Can you, um, can you tell us the relationship between two uh, Yeah, we're... we're <laughs> she's my daughter. Yeah, we're, she's like my mother. Yeah. Yeah. Aiden, just, just One so my mother. understand what went on, can, can you re recount what happened? Or? I think we need to go. Yeah, yeah. Okay. yeah. we have to go. Thank you very much. Thank you. Just the one thing, the, the ticket was for what? Okay, so that was the woman that police arrested, the only arrest so far this morning. She was briefly detained, put in a police vehicle, and then yeah, released I'm a very ready. short time later. Police have told us that she was charged with trespassing, and our Melanie Ng saw a yellow ticket in her hand, as well as her belongings that were returned to her. 